does it profit a man to gain the whole world and lose his soul? Worn out. short on Marcion. Marcion was probably the most important Christian thinker of the second century. He was a, uh, a kind of a teacher philosopher type from, uh, from uh, Asia Minor who, uh, who took the Apostle Paul very seriously when Paul differentiated between the gospel of Christ and the, and the law of the Jews. Paul thought that a person could not be made right with God by, by keeping the requirements of the Jewish law, but a person had to have faith in Christ. And so this differentiation between law and gospel for Marcion became an absolute differentiation. That the God who gave the law could not be the God who, uh, who gave the gospel. So that Marcion taught that there were actually two different gods. That the God of the Old Testament was in fact a different God from the God of Jesus. That the God of Jesus in fact tried to save people from the condemnation of the God of the Jews. The idea is the God of the Jews created this world gave Israel the law, everybody breaks this law, and so this Jewish God condemns them. Justly. I mean, they broke the law, so they're condemned. Jesus comes from a higher God who never had anything to do with this world before Jesus showed up. Jesus came to save people from the wrathful God of the Jews. Uh, and so Marcion tried to propound this point of view and, and won a lot of converts. In fact, in his day, he was extremely successful. Uh, there were a lot of Marcionite churches that started up. And in some parts of the Christian world, it looks like the, this Marcionite understanding of Christianity was the dominant form of Christianity. In this form of Christianity, the, the, Jew, the, the Christian Bible didn't have an Old Testament because that was the, that was the book of the Jews. And it had the, the Christian New Testament consisted of Paul's letters, Marcy knew of ten, ten of Paul's letters, and one gospel, the Gospel of Luke. So it was Luke and, and ten letters. I mean, some of us are glad that Marcy didn't succeed because those of us who teach New Testament would only have half-time jobs now.
Uh, and the sky.